sprinting away from the 1200 meter marker in chambermaids a little bit sluggish out the gate as they settle down and race towards the 1100 online very quick to go russia girl is right there on the left hand side bella Mies. All of the Highfeld Hawks right, right there in the middle of the division as they move down towards the 800 meter marker. They are followed further back in the field at this stage by Princess Analia. Then comes Danish Cross in the all black. We're watching you. Chamber made Diamond in the skies towards the outside. And then La Sota and Matar followed by Royal Katrina. Just outside the 500 meter marker now. And it's wide open. They're right across the track. La Sota and Matar. Diamond in the sky there Russian girls also well placed Royal Katrina also trying to run on there Bellamy Esque we're watching you getting to the 200 diamond in the sky La Sute de Motar Russian girl chambermaids running on from behind La Sute de Motar on the inside Princess Analia diamond in the sky La Sute de Motar and chambermaids taking off diamond in the sky probably won it diamond in the sky Princess Analia chambermaid Close call, I think number one, a diamond in the sky, the filly by VAR will probably just win it. Princess Analia is on the inside, La Sota de Matar, chamber maid, diamond in the sky is coming well. And didn't Sheldon give you this one this morning, 20 to 1, diamond in the sky. Princess Analia and chamber maid, very close second and third, La Sota de Matar is further back in the run. Bella Miesk and Russia Girl. Look at that. One, two, three, four, five, seven horses. There's about two lengths covering the first seven over the line. Then online. We're watching you. Danish Cross, Power Horse. So as we look at the head on Diamond in the Sky, 142 days off the track. Come Naidu. And comes Goodyear to win. And I'll just give you that update of what it is paying on the tote. Diamond in the Sky for the KZ in Falcons. And Warren Kennedy. And uh, it is paying up at 880, opened up at 20 to 1, pays still 310 a place. Tote favorite was number 8. They're still the ninth and last of that quartet. Very shortly, we'll give you an update on how the Riders' Cup went back to the studio. Just seen Diamond in the Sky reproduce her best form. She's come through and she's fought on courageously. Com, she's a horse who's got the ability and probably enjoyed a bit of a break. Yeah, Sheldon, uh, we got her and uh, also from Alesha, I must say thanks to him, you know, for allowing us to buy her. And uh, we gave her a break and we brought her back into work. Her work has been outstanding. I said to many, uh, this filly's work has been really good. She's been off for a while and if she's not needing the run, she'll go very very close and uh, Warren came and he sat on her and he said the same thing to me he says you know that's winning work she's put up just well done to the guys you know Jared and Tristan they've been working this horse in the mornings and uh, unfortunately couldn't ride there but uh, well done to them well done to Manny and his family nice to have a winner for them and uh, his daughter's colors is lucky it's nice that the stables turned the corner so hopefully the winners come thick and fast yeah, Sheldon, it's been a dry spell and we had a winner the other day, another one today. So let's just hope it continues. Just well done to the whole team. Sean, all the guys at home, you know, they put in hard work. You've seen them in the morning, so got to give them the credit also. Well done. There's your bottle of champagne. Thanks, Sheldon. And to Hollywood, our sponsors. Thanks. Well done to Kom Naidu, Matthew Sham, Director of New Turf Carriers, giving the champagne to Kom Naidu, and that'll go down very, very nicely. Warren Kennedy, we had a chat to you during the week, just after you'd worked her, and you said she put up some terrific work. She did, Sheldon. She gave me very nice work. Like I said, I couldn't fault her work. She dropped down in the merit rating. There were one or two issues that Kom sorted out, and she hopped out smartly today. I just had to hold her together. She probably needed this run a little bit, so I just waited a bit longer than I, than I would have normally. But um, she fought them off doggily towards the end. She won a good race. Well done to you. Thanks very much. Just well done to New Turf. Thank you for the, for the opportunity to ride in the challenge. It's a, it's a great initiative. The guys really have good fun. And I'm glad to get one on the board for the Falcons. Bottle of champagne for Warren Kennedy. Putting it together. Diamond in the sky. We're going to get the winning connections. They're going to be elated. Let's get them all into the picture here, taking over Diamond in the Sky. And coming to the course today, there was a bit of a buzz about her today. 
I, I don't know about the buzz because the trainer tells me, no, uh, you know, we needed this run, she'll need the run today. But uh, the jockey gave me a little bit of confidence. Warren was quite confident, but he said too, more of a place chance. But uh, in saying this, I want to give my good friend Alesh, uh, thank, say thank you to him because he sold his horse to me and he actually forced me to buy, buy this horse for 35000 35,000. That's a steal. Yeah, I think it was, I think it was my birthday. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well done to you. Thank you to Alesh. Thank you to Warren. Thank you to Kami. Thank you to everyone. Well, there's Champagne, the photos. Want to have the final word? Uh, just well done to everybody, and we are excited for the win. Thank you. Here we go. The champagne's going to be popping. Well done to all the connections. They've taken over Diamond in the Sky, and she's managed to edge them out in the closing stages. Opa, that is the winning groom, so we're going to get Opa in, I believe that's his name. He's going to come and get his winning prize for looking after Diamond in the Sky. Well done to all. Diamond in the Sky has come back from the break, and she's fought them off in the closing stages. Welcome back to the parade ring here at Scottsville, and it's been an absolute pleasure to witness the uh, rider, the Interprovincial Rider Cup here at Scottsville today, and it's been also a magnificent pleasure to work with Matthew and Michael Sham uh, from New Turf Carriers who have sponsored this challenge. And on behalf of all the management staff and directors of Gold Circle, we'd like to thank uh, the Sham family for their sponsorship of the Interprovincial Rider Cup. Thanks must go to Graham Hawkins and his marketing team, Raf Sheikh, the racing executive of Gold Circle, and to everybody that uh, took part in today's uh, event, a big thank you to everybody. We, we heard the results. Craig Peters has given us in third place was the Cape Eagles at 121 points. Second was the KZN Falcons on 145, and the Halfald Hawks take home the money. They take home the uh, uh, trophy, and they take home their... Uh, uh, medals as well. So with me and for the presentation is Matthew and Michael Sham if you'd like to come forward and uh, we'd like to put the uh, winning um, uh, medals on uh, our jockeys. It's Lyle Hewitson, Craig Zaki, Marco van Rensburg and Gavin Lorena. There we go. And Raf Sheikh will bring forward the uh, Floating trophy, a round of applause. Thank you, everybody. A round of applause for the Highfeld Hawks. There we go. There we go. Well done, guys. I just want to have a word with Gavin Lorena, who is the captain of uh, the Highfeld Hawks. Gav, uh, you were the captain, and there were a few changes made during the week with regards to riders for unforeseen circumstances. But uh, what was the mood like? What was the vibe like up in the jockey room? You know, to a young team, and uh, well done to all the boys. They you know, they came here today, we were the underdogs, but we had a plan and we were confident in ourselves and we, we went out there and did our best uh, with what we were given. And it turned out a beautiful day. Big thank you to New Turf Carriers, to the Sham family, to Gold Circle, and most of all, well done to my, to my young team, um, the, the boys of the future. Gav, a lot of people have asked me, you know, what are your plans? You've been riding a bit overseas. Maybe you want to share with the racing public, what is Gavin Lorena's plans? Um, well, we, I stayed here for today, and lucky enough, I got on to New Credit and the Mercury Sprint next Saturday. And then I'm off to England for the next three or four weeks just to finish up my contract. And, uh, you know, looking forward to it, but at the same time, can't wait to get on. Gav, to you and your team, thank you for your participation, and we wish you guys all the very best. Thank you, and well done, boys. There we go. That's Gavin Lorena, the Highfeld Hawks, their young team. He calls them a young team. He's not a, an old boy himself, so well done to them. And uh, once again, to new turf carriers, Matthew and Michael Sham, and of course, not forgetting the loadmaster, Philip Free, for all their hard work that they've put into this event. On behalf of the entire team at Gold Circle, we thank you.